Hey, Joel. Hello. Oh, that's not a very warm greeting. Oh my God, what happened to your eye? My kids beat the shit out of me. Oh my God, Joel. It's okay, you... it's okay, it's my fault. I raised them to be fans of this awful godforsaken, I mean godforsaken franchise, the Detroit Lions. Now, Joel, I remember you saying you sent your kids to trade school. Was the trade they learned? Beating your ass? It, it was a worse trade than the one we made for Quandre Diggs. We gave away Quandre Diggs because he was piping up in the locker room. We sent him to Seattle. Then I see him seal games on Monday nights. He's not good enough for us, but now he's good enough for a playoff contender. It just doesn't make sense. Sure. Today, this Sunday, we gave it up to the Cowboys easier than Jake Gyllenhaal and Brokeback Mountain. Brokeback Mountain, that describes both our quarterback's medical maladies mm -hmm. and what he needs to overcome to get this team to even just a wild card loss. Matt Patricia, this supposed defensive genius from the Patriots, he took a, a collection of talent. Trey Flowers, Darius Slay, and they turned him into the 32nd ranked defense in the league. Good our, guy though. Why is our coach the only rapist in America what? who gets to keep his job. Yes. What? Yeah. He ran through a hotel door the way Mitch Trubisky ran through his defense last Sunday. And yet, he's allowed to be in charge because he's friends with Bob Quinn, our general manager. Bob Quinn, he is carrying on the sacred Detroit lineage of drafting a useless tight end in the first round. Brandon Pettigrew, Eric Ebron, now TJ Hawkinson, they're all the same. They look good at the combine, then they hit the field, and they have as good hands as Saudi Arabian shoplifters. What? Yes. What indeed? TJ Hawkinson in the end zone has mo the most disappointing drops since Eric Clapton's son explored the window. That was a big one. Joel. What? Most of this is just so devastating. It, this isn't even the worst part. Charles Rogers, the greatest homegrown Michigan athlete, was drafted by the Lions number two overall. He died this week. We did nothing oh to put him on the right path. We allowed him to slip into addiction and be hounded by the people from his hometown. And today is, he is dead because he was drafted by the Detroit Lions. Someone hasn't mishandled a receiver like that since Naomi Campbell hit her assistant with a telephone. Charles Rogers came from Flint and the only way he could be worse off is if he stayed at home and drank from a faucet. Joel, have you tried beat poetry before? I've been beaten enough by the Cowboys, by the Bears, I by think. the Raiders, by the, my own yeah. children. Don't worry about me, doctor. I am this worried about you. This team cannot hurt me anymore because I'm already dead. Anyway, I'm going to the Washington game next weekend. Can't wait. Should be a great time. Be a fun one. Jeff Driscoll, it'll be wonderful. Hell yeah, baby.